Shen has created a weapon that breathes fire and spits metal. Unless he is stopped, this could mean the end of Kung Fu. But I just got Kung Fu! And now, you must save it. She's very smart. She's visually astute. She's quite quiet. Jen, Jen is one of the best board artists there are. I think it was it was only a matter of time before she, she got up and directed a movie. And, and in this movie, she's shown what she can do. Jen makes it feel very cool and relaxed. She has a very calm air about her, and her like passion for the project is, uh, is very contagious. Well, she was a natural choice for, for a director, and I, I think she's done a wonderful job. Uh, she certainly has the sensitivity of being a director for this great movie. Here we go! Remember, Dragon Warrior, <laughs> when you follow the noble path, <laughs> anything is possible. Well, when the first movie came around, I just heard about it as the title. I mean, Kung Fu Panda. And that's all I heard, and I said, I want that. And so I was one of the first people on the movie, the first one. And I was the head of story, and I also directed the opening 2D sequence on the first movie. When the opportunity came up to do directing for the second one, I said, sure, that'd be cool. No one noticed or pointed out or seemed to care one way or the other whether their director was a male or a female. And I think that's the way it should be, that you're a director. You're not a woman or a man director. You're just a director. You're making the film that you want to make without gender being involved at all.